Hello, my name is Sarah DeWong. I am a project manager and consultant at Concentris. Today, I just wanted to give you a quick overview of custom segments and why they are better than just your standard list. So to create a custom segment, it's fairly easy. You just go to customizations, list records, and go to custom segments and new. It'll take you to this page um, where I've already created one, sales region. Let me take a look at that right now. Um, so you can come into a page and it's very similar to creating a new field or a new um, list, um, entity list or transaction list. Um, the first thing you want to do is label it, the type, the display. Okay. And the key thing is down here are the values. So you can enter in the values and the rest is very similar. Um, what applications it applies to. Um, if you're going to make it mandatory, if there's any default um, selections. Okay. So creating a custom segment is very similar, like I said, similar to creating a, a, a new field or a new list. What I want to show you is that that custom segment would show up. And the difference between the custom segment and a typical list is that this actually will be a filter or a way to segment your financial statements. So that is a key distinction. Um, you'll see down here in classification, departments, class, and uh, locations. So those are our standard kind of um, native built-in uh, segmentations. Sales region will act very similar to those segments. And what I wanna show you is on the income statement here. So this is a standard income statement. What I did was I, in the column, I filtered it for sales region. So right here is the ability to filter it by your segmentation. So normally you would see, for instance, your department and your location here and by subsidiary. But now because this is a custom segment and not just um, a list um, on a list field on your, your uh, uh, transactions, it will come up here as a way to segment your financial statements. So you would select um, sales region or sales region um, hierarchy, and you would click refresh, and you'll see that your income statement is automatically broken out um, by the way you segmented your, um, in this instance, my invoices for revenue. Okay, So that's a quick overview of custom segments and um, the difference between a segment and just a typical list.